Hello my fellow bats, welcome back to my channel. So I'm sure you can tell by the box and the title, obviously, what this video is gonna be about and I am so excited, let me tell you why, okay? I have wanted Birkin Hair Co. candles for years, okay? And I've never had the chance to get them, okay? So when I finally did have the chance and I saw the email notification that that the specific candle that I wanted was back in stock, I jumped on it. I had to, I had to. And I was like, you know what, it's time. Well, I asked Alex and he said yes, but. Anyways, <laughs> so this is going to be a Burke and Hairco candle unboxing. This is my first time ever ordering from them and I am so excited. I've wanted to order from them, like I said, for years. And um, if you don't know, the company themselves or itself whatever they were established in 2011 I think it is or was <laughs> but if you don't know the story about William Burke and William Hare you need to look it up I'm so excited oh, I've wanted these candles for so long y'all don't understand okay so you open it up it has these things here what are they it's a scent sample oh and a sticker which is really cute Halloween sticker there's this card that's really cute. Another card. This is for the candle, oh my goth. Oh, yes, and that is the candle that I was waiting so long for. Another card, spooky season. And then this is the order slip or whatever you wanna call it. Anyways, black tissue paper, of course. And then there, it looks like they have some of this, you know, butcher packing paper underneath. And then it, I apologize if you can hear Logan out in the hallway. Anyways, so you can see each candle is individually wrapped. So that's good. I'm kind of nervous. Like which one do I start with? I ordered six, right? I can't remember. It looks like six. We'll just start with this one right here. I really hope the camera's focused on me. I can't really see myself. Like I can see the viewfinder, but it's far away because I was too lazy to set up my laptop and everything anyways candle number one <laughs> gosh Ooh, uh, there's i don't know what that is but it's soft so it was wrapped in this and then wrapped in this but first wrapped in black tissue paper of course and it has a broken hair coast sticker i'm gonna put this gonna be a mess by the time I'm done filming this video. Ew. Ew. Egypt. Oh, it's so gorgeous. It feels so high quality. It's so clean. Oh my gosh, yes. I won't smell it yet. I won't smell it yet. Or, yeah, I'll smell it. I'll smell it. Okay, Egypt. Let's see how this is. Hmm. Smells like what I imagine Egypt would smell like, I suppose. I'm not like a scent person. I'm not like the type of person who can smell something and be like, oh yeah, there's, you know, this and that in there, walnuts and almonds and thyme and whatever. Like, I mean, obviously I know what thyme smells like, but you know what I'm saying? Like if there's a mix of things, I'm not gonna be like, oh, it has this, 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 and this in there, you know? I like it, it smells good. I imagine this is something that I would burn. Well, I don't know, when would I burn this? Maybe when I was in my office doing something, what, what would I be doing? Maybe editing. I don't know, I like this one, it's nice. Next one. Ew, ah, I'm so excited about this one too. Cathedral, mm, it's just so pretty, it's just so pretty. There are so many more candles that I wanted you guys, but honestly the majority of them were out of stock. Which was why, I mean, it's like every time I went on their website, the ones that I wanted were out of stock. So I was like, as soon as that particular candle um, that we'll get to, um, as soon as I was notified that that was back in stock, I was like, I need to do it now. Otherwise it's never going to happen. <laughs> this is their dark wave collection, by the way, these. Yeah, they're both the dark wave collection. I don't think it smells like a cathedral. but it's comforting. 
I can get the whole rever like feeling of reverence maybe. It's more of like a comforting scent. Like this is a scent I would probably burn. Honestly, it kind of makes me think of like summer or like poopery or whatever that word is or incense, but not like, it doesn't have that smokiness. Hmm, I like that one. That one's nice. That one's, yeah, that one's comforting. This is one I, I imagine I would burn. Well, maybe because it also kind of has summer vibes. Anyways, moving on to the next one. Okay, this one, oh, this is, I think it's from specifically like their Halloween collection. Um, this is the one Haunted. It says cinnamon, birch, and clove. So this one, these ones, the lids I think are tin. This one, it's plastic. So, but the, ac but this, actually, I don't know what that is. This is glass, the holder. Mmm. Okay, I lied. This one, this one, this is one that I would burn maybe like near or, well, obviously I wouldn't, I wouldn't burn my books. That's not what I'm trying to say. What I'm trying to say is like, this is the scent that, that I would have going around my books. Does that make sense? Like think old, maybe library, maybe. But it also smells like fall, like fall in a cemetery. Wow, I like that one. Okay, next one. Um, I can't remember what collection this is from or if it's from a collection, maybe Black Label or something. Anyways, this is the Autumn Forever Candle. Apple, clove, sage, and brown sugar. I should have grabbed coffee beans to like, to reset my nostrils. <laughs> wow, you can really smell that apple, dude. In the brown sugar, oh yeah, this is, oh yeah, this is, and it, it I, what I love about this is that it doesn't give me a headache because a lot of the autumn fall vibe candles that I smell, they always, not always, but a lot of the time they give me headaches. This one doesn't. This one is nice. This is one I would burn while I was sitting next to the fire. <laughs> yeah, I like that one. Mmm, I like that one. That one's cozy too. Okay. Second to last one. Oh yes. This is the candle. This is the candle I have been waiting for. Oh my goth. Dude, yes. Oh yes. Oh, this is, oh yes. Okay. It looks like the, they might've got something on the lid, but you know what? I don't care. I don't care. I love it. I don't even have to smell it. I love it. Okay. <laughs> it says it's a moody blend inspired by black eyeliner, graveyards, and bats. Ugh, yes. Okay. Need to emotionally prepare myself. Call me dramatic. I don't care. I just... Yeah. I just want to keep smelling it. It also kind of has like male cologne vibes. I'm thinking a lot, but words aren't coming out. I just want to enjoy this. I really like this. I, I very much like this. I really like this. Yes. Yes to this. Yes. If you're wondering if you should get it, doesn't even matter if you like the sense in it, just get it. Just get it. All right, last one. This one is called Phantom. It's one of their, um, it's another one of their, I can put this over here. It's another one of their Halloween candles. And it's so cute. Okay, it, it says it has cranberry, currant, and pine. I love pine. I also like cranberry. Wow, that hits you before you even like, <laughs> before it even like, I really like this. Oh my gosh. Maybe it's the cranberry. I really like, I really like the mix of the cranberry and the pine. Oh my gosh. This makes me want to eat it. Like this makes me, like it makes me think of like cherry chapstick, except not obviously. Oh. <sighs> 
This also is kind of comforting. Also kind of makes me think of fall, maybe like mold wine, you know? Mm. Wow, I really like this. This is sweet. This like makes my mouth water. Oh my gosh, yeah. Okay, oh wow, I love it. I am more than satisfied. I, I am so grateful and so glad. I want, I'm gonna go back when I have money, I'm gonna go back and buy more, maybe if Alex will, if Alex is okay with it. Um, but oh my gosh, yes, I, I'm very happy. I'm very satisfied. I love all of these scents. I, I don't think I have a favorite. I can't pick a favorite. I also don't have a least favorite. Yeah, I don't have a least favorite. Um, I love them all. I, I love it. I love it. I'm so grateful. This is great. Um, yeah, quick little video for you guys, but um, yeah, hope you guys enjoyed. I will leave Birkin Hair Co. link down below for you guys, as well as each of the candles that I got, so you can peruse their website for yourself. And yeah, that's all I got for this one. Thanks so much for watching. I will see you guys in the next video. Bye.